Hey, what's up guys? I want to turn so far video. So, so far it just almost broke $10. I think it actually briefly broke $10, but I think it is not yet confirmed. So it is just right now breaking this old resistance from a couple of days ago on 14 December 2023. And I, I think it's going to be very bullish for so far, uh, mostly because the overall uh, financial sector is also starting to recover. Uh, so people are not necessarily as afraid of a sudden recession as they were in the past because I think uh, the fear was that the interest rates would cause a recession if they held it too long, right? If, if they hold it too long, uh, a lot of businesses will start to shut down and a lot of uh, jobs will start to get uh, 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 lost, right? So uh, I think that is out of the way right now. So the overall financial sector is looking uh, upwards right now. So you'll notice just on the technicals on the one hour chart there isn't a lot of selling uh for sofi i would actually expect this to go up now i know the bollinger band right now it is at the peak of the bollinger band and uh, rsi right now is also a overbought right but uh just look at the macro i think the macro is going to be good for financials as well i also want to take a look at the past performance of sofi the very very recent past You'll notice that um, so far has been down a lot uh, since then. So I think all this built up pressure uh, is going to start coming back into the stock. And I don't know what price it will make so far. Uh, I, I think, you know, 10 to 11 is going to be the range where it will start to consolidate and it is hitting to 10 right now. So we'll see if I'm around that. And um, yeah, so um, this is so far. Let's zoom out a little bit here. On the one day chart, we have the uh, RSI breaking to a overbought and MACD also breaking uh, to, you know, extreme, extreme green. I don't necessarily see this sort of curling down very quickly. I think it will take at least uh, a couple a couple of days, maybe four or five days before we hit another red. So before we cycle to a another red again. But I think the most important thing to look out for is the one week chart. So the one week chart, we just broke into the green and we are still in the green. It looks like, uh, you know, if it's if we are lucky, we still might have a couple more weeks to run. So once again, 10 to 11 is where I'm looking at. And, uh, you know, if we are very, very optimistic, we could hit 12. I don't know about that. Um, predicting short term stocks are, are very hard, but that's just where I'm looking. So thank you guys for watching. Like, subscribe. See you in the next one.